Sweden. Gothenburg. This is Susan Hansen. She lives right at the Gothenburg Harbor. And she knows the meaning of harbor. No idyllic landscape, but instead a lot of noise, vibration, exhaust fumes, and stench, because the ships docked at the pier for loading and unloading still use energy. A lot of energy. This means that engines are also running when the cargo ships are not at sea. And this again means the environment continues to be polluted. Few people know that international shipping by cargo ships pollutes the air more heavily than does air traffic by causing a hundredfold higher sulfur dioxide emission. But everything is different in Gothenburg. There is less noise. There are by far fewer vibrations. There is less foul air than in other places. Scandinavia's largest harbor located at Sweden's western seaboard forces ships to shut their diesel engines off not letting them burn poisonous heavy fuel oil as soon as they lie at anchor. Instead, they use green electricity through OPS, the onshore power supply. The onshore power supply technology is a measure to reduce the environmental impact and improve the local air quality here in Gothenburg. It can also achieve a great reduction in climate impact when we are using alternative energy. In order to optimize this green concept and to create environmentally friendly energy for onshore power supply, two wind turbines were installed at the Gothenburg Harbor. This means silent energy instead of loud, smelly engines. In the year 2000, Gothenburg was the world's first harbor to provide OPS high-voltage power to cargo ships. This not only increased working conditions on all the piers and ships, but also helped improve air quality in the city itself. I love this city, but the latest 20 years there has been a lot of noise, uh, smelling, um, now that this project has been reality, it's much more cleaner for our children to grow up, it's perfect. I can see a bright future for us who are citizens in this town. Today, 30% of all vessels coming to Port of Gothenburg are able to use this technology. And it's a quite high number if we look internationally. And we are really proud and happy with the figure and we are working hard to increase the number even more uh, in the future. Environmental awareness has considerably increased during the last years, including that of harbor authorities around the globe. Gothenburg serves as an example to the entire world because the system can be implemented absolutely anywhere, independent of climate, temperature, latitude or longitude, in whatever way the users want. Gothenburg Harbor and its revolutionary onshore power supply, a deserved winner in the category Air. <laughs>